Okay, so when my uncle came over, I've unboxed three airplane models. And, um, yeah. This A380 is out for extra, and this is not unboxed, and I have to detail the bottom right now. So, yeah, let's get into the ones that I unboxed. Do you see the front? Let me give you a hint. Okay, so the end of its tail is all yellow. I'm talking about, like, the back part of the, um, tail. Time out. I was talking about this part. Besides, Singapore Airlines. It's a 777. That's how this hill came out. Pretty crud. Pretty cruddy, and, um, this model looks really nice. I'm saying that the part like that was cruddy. So, um, if you look closer, there's something I never know known that was on Singapore Airlines. So, I never knew that the Singapore flag was on Singapore Airlines, and, um, usually I... Never knew that triple sevens have this part. Maybe they did in the past. Yeah, they did in the past. Okay, so putting this model back here. The rest of them had stands. This one did have a stand, but, you know, I'll get it now. You no, know, it's on an airplane already because, um, you know, it would just keep falling off the stand. Good thing these models aren't really breakable. Next up, we have... The Lufthansa A380. So if you look closer to both these models, none is fatter than another. Even though the A380 is much thicker. But it's cause it, it usually happens. I, I I don't know even I don't even know why. Yeah, the Lufthansa A380. You want you want me to give you a fun fact about it? So we were moving into this new house that I got in 2017. I lost the airplane. It was in the dirt. I found it somehow. Well, it, on my old house, even though we're at the new house. So, um, yeah, then I, um, yeah, then I was, you know, playing with the model somehow. Even though I'm, I know now I'm not supposed to play with airplane models, which I don't do that anymore. I don't even play on my planes anymore because they're collectibles. And they're not really just collectibles. They are, um, models. And, yeah. It even has a schedule over here, and it says Lufthansa.com. Lufthansa thing over here. And I don't think the model that I had had all that, but I just know... It looked like a Skymarks plane. I can't show you the picture. I have a picture of it, but it's in my phone. And I'm recording from that phone. Oh, wait. I deleted it. <laughs> Never mind. So, still. I just, I just lost it again when I was playing with it somehow. It's sad news. Alright, next one, wait, last one, last one is the MRT 380. So, yeah, I just noticed, but on these models, the back, the bottom is detailed, which is really nice. Now, I have another of these A380s, but it's not scheduled, it's on schedule on, by, by the tail wing and the tail. And, uh, oh, let me get it. It's this, and it's the Darren model. So, if you look close to both of these models, it just look at the engines and the just look at the engines. This one has its own detail. This one doesn't. I I don't really think it has a detail. Maybe it does. If so I will detail it. You know I don't. I won't because um it's a model and I know I'm not supposed to touch it. So, yeah. 
If this is the winglet of both of them. Now, if you look at, if you look like, maybe you can't, but it's detailed on the winglet. All right, now you can see, you saw, you just saw, it's right here, and this one has nothing. Okay, so, the worst, okay, so if you look on the back of both of these models, which one, which one of these looks more realistic to their own tail? I'll give you five seconds. Okay, that was five seconds, and it's this one, because, um, you see, it just, I don't know how to explain it, but I just know this one's more realistic. And besides, if you look at the windows, you see this one's like clear as crystal, and this one's all black, which is what it's supposed to be. This is a better model. Now, the worst review of all, the cockpit. So if you see on the newer model, also known as the one I just got today in the mailbox. Uh, hold on. Yeah, it's five doors. And on this one, it has five doors. Perfect. So, this is a th Airbus A300. This one doesn't, somehow. But still, the other one's better. I don't care about the small designs. And if you look really closely, this one also doesn't say www.emmerich.com, and this one does. Maybe it's because this is an older model. So, if you look at the cockpit, this is just like some weird, thin, weird, stupid, or stoopy cockpit. And this one, this one has a nice cockpit. And also, just look on the bottom of this, and look on the bottom of the other one. Yeah, I had to detail the other one because it didn't even look realistic with the bottom detailed. So, in your opinion, which one is better? So, if I still had my other Lufthansa plane, I still would have, you know, done the thing I did with these two amateur aircraft. So, how'd you like the video? Cool, wasn't it? So, now I'll be putting the airplanes back on their stands. So, here's the bad aircraft stand. I'm putting it on now. Then you'll tell me how it looks on the stand. Wait. I'm sorry, guys. You have to wait. Hold on. I'll pause it. Ah, uh, there we go. Now let's do the Emirates airplane. Which one is it? Stand. So if you put the stand on this one, you can't really see the bottom's detail, but for, you know what, whatever. I don't care about the bottom detail. The other thing I care about is that they're models, and they're not toys. And they're real airlines is another fact. Okay, so these are the new models. And this was just a showcase model that I got last year on December 2019. If I never had that model, this would have been my first Emirates. And if I didn't lose my other one, and if I didn't even have it also, this would be my first Lufthansa, and this would have already my first new Portland. So, uh, yeah. It's really all for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll, I'll see you on my next video. So, um, how does it look with all the rest of my planes? And I have another amount announcement, too, which is not going to be in the title description. Well, in the title of the video. I just made another custom today. And if you take, if you, if you take a closer look at it, it's the American Airlines 777 in the old livery. Yeah, again, it's Darren, and, um, yeah. So I got those three from my uncle. These, 
Those are this, this, and that. And yeah, basically, I was gonna do an unboxing review, but my uncle wanted me to come outside and unwrap them in front of him. So yeah. And speaking of American Airlines, this is a really cool American Airlines custom. I didn't add the windows because I was too lazy. Oh, and also, same here. I did a United Airlines custom. Oh, yeah, I did add the windows. I didn't know that. I thought I didn't even add the windows at all. Oh, my favorite part is the left side of the tail. Just look at it. Look at how realistic it is. If you look on the other side, what is that? I just lost, I lost it on how, how to draw the United Airlines tails. So anyway, thank you for watching the video and you know what. Bye-bye.